Welcome back to another video. Um, today, I am finally going to figure out my mic outputs. Topic, meet my mic outputs. Output 1. Standard microphone. Nothing added. No equalizer APO. No voice meter banana. OBS is set to my microphone only. And I will now make sure. Yes, microphone only. Output 2. Have to change OBS from my microphone into VB output. I will now turn on VB output. And I'm trying something new with my mic. I put cat ears on it. <laughs> This is for fun. Okay, now I have to change OBS. Audio from microphone to voice VB output. This is before I hit apply. I hit apply. There is no EQ. I gotta go back to my PowerPoint. Output 2. Microphone with voice meter banana. My settings. No equalizer APO. Voice meter banana only with compression, bass, and... What's this other thing that I did? Oh, the FX Echo, and that's it. <clears throat> so once again, that is bass, FX Echo, toggle, and position toggle, and voice meter banana. Once again, OBS is set to VB output instead of my just my microphone. Now I have to go into equalizer APO to turn that on for output 3. This has been output 2 before I change into output 3. Output 3. Microphone with equalizer APO. E equalizer APO is set to voice meter output and I will go now no no this is okay output 3.1 I made a boo-boo this is no going back to my PowerPoint microphone with equalizer APO Set to my microphone. OBS is set to VB output, so I have to fix that. So I'm going to type this. I forgot to uh, make sure everything was okay. So 
new slide output output 3.2 I'll just say output 4 but it's not really OBS is set to VB output equalizer APO is set to my microphone nothing else was changed okay Now I am going to change the device in APO to voice meter output. Now this is output three, the correct way. This is microphone with equalizer APO. Equalizer APO is correctly set to VB output. Voice meter banana is now with equalizer APO. Voice meter banana with compression and no VB EQ. Voice meter banana has a built in equalizer that is not selected. Once again, OBS is set to VB output. Hopefully, I did this correctly. That's why I, I wrote that output for, even though. There might not be any difference, or there could be. But I had to make sure voice meter banana output was selected in OBS, or none of this would have worked. That is why I had to correct myself on the fly, because I once again forgot to check the device in equalizer APO to switch from my regular microphone to VB output. I am using shorthand when I say VB output, I mean voice meter output. I'm pretty sure that is, um, Yes, voice meter output or VB aud wait VB audio voice meter VAO. Hopefully, I did choose the right one in uh, the I'm trying to find it. Configurator of Equalizer APO. Yes, there's only an auxiliary voice meter AUX output. I just have voice meter output selected. Oh, and it also says experimental, so chances are that probably is not the right one. So, chances are I do have that uh, set up correctly. And this has been my final, hopefully my final and last video of microphone output setup and testing. That is why I did this PowerPoint to heal the exact effects. effects to heal each set correctly. Yeah, th that's it. Um, until we meet again.
Welcome back to another video. I made a mistake in my PowerPoint, but I will not be showing that here. Actually, you know what, I am going to make that a longer video, string them together. More content is better, more voice better, it's all good. Process, um, show the fields of how I got to my correct setting. And yeah, let's just get into it. Welcome to meet my mic outputs and the correct settings. Output 1. Standard microphone, nothing added. No equalizer APO, no voice meter banana. OBS is set to my microphone only. Now, I will change OBS into Output 2. And turn on VB. Okay, we are back with voice meter banana turned on. Output 2. Microphone with voice meter banana. My settings. No equalizer APO. Voice meter banana with compression and without the built-in equalizer that voice meter banana has. OBS is set to VB output. Now I will be turning on output 3. Output 3. Microphone with Equalizer APO. Equalizer APO is set to VB output. Voice meter banana is now with Equalizer APO. Voice meter banana with compression and no VB equalizer. OBS is set to voice meter banana output. Output 3.5. OBS is set to VB output. EQ equalizer APO is going to be now set to my microphone. Equalizer APO is set to my microphone now. Nothing else was changed. For output 4, I now have to deselect and turn off voice meter banana. Shut down voice meter. We are back with output output 4. OBS is now set to my microphone. Equalizer APO is set to my microphone. Voice meter banana has been turned off and deselected. As for output 3 and output 3.5, apparently both ways work the same. There is no apparent change. I could be wrong because I was typing when I did that uh, last part of this video. And I forgot to put output 4 with Zest Equalizer APO only. 
And at long last, I will now decide what set settings outputs that I will be using. But there is one last thing that I need to do. So I am going back to output three. Meaning change back to voice emitter banana with this other preset. So I will now do that. Turn on you. Open you. Loaded. Now change OBS into VB. And we are back with output 3 and output 3.5. Now I will be turning off equalizer APO. Equalizer APO has been turned off. Now I will load a preset for voice meter banana. Okay, we are back with voice meter banana turned on. I had to manually turn on microphone and the cable output and the speakers for voice meter banana. I forgot to do that the last time when I loaded this preset. This is no compression, no bass, no position, nothing on the I-N-T-E-L-L-I-P-A-N. That is the, the box you above the compression and gain. This is with an equalizer preset of voice meter banana. So I will now show you what in the world I am talking about. So I did that uh, to begin with, but I didn't. Okay, this is the the box that I was talking about. Radio, this thing that I am moving. This is a preset that I have loaded with an equalizer. So I will now show the equalizer. Window capture, yes. Okay. This is the equalizer preset that I have loaded. I will now go turn on voice equal I am now turning on equalizer APO with this preset. Equalizer APO has been turned on. Now I am going to turn off this gain. The gain has been turned off because voice, I mean, equalizer APO already has a noise gate turned on. This has once been 
once again has been Equalizer APO with Voice Meter Banana Preset. I will now load my settings for Voice Meter Banana. Load settings. Load. We still have the equalizer, but as you can tell, I have a a dot a a marker in this squell. This is what I changed. Only two things here. Nothing else has been changed in that box. I have a compression. I have the equalizer in voice meter banana. I also have equalizer APO turned on. Nothing else has been changed. I am now going to turn off equalizer APO. I have turned off Equalizer APO. I have now Voice Meter Banana. My settings with the Equalizer preset that I have loaded, nothing else was changed. Now I will load my other setting of VB. I have just loaded my first settings. This came from Voice Meter Basic. If I didn't know any better, this squirrel didn't really change. The only thing I changed was the base, not the position. The voice only was changed in this setting. There is probably barely any difference. Now I will be turning on Equalizer APO with my first settings with the Equalizer preset in Voice Meter Banana. I have turned on Equalizer APO with my voice emitter banana setting one with the preset equalizer still turned on nothing else was changed now i am going to turn off voice emitter banana preset of its equalizer So to do that, all I have to do is bring... Oh. Um... Apparently there was no EQ going on, so... My bad. Uh, but now I get to see the Settings 1 versus settings 2. Um.
Okay, we are back. I have to manually turn on the base. Oh, I think it was about Q. Turn on A1. And turn off B1 so you do not heal this. Okay, this is now my settings with the the preset of equalizer banana. Nothing else was changed, so I will now save this. Okay, that is now voice emitter banana equalizer presets and my added tweaks to the box and the compression. Nothing else was changed. Now I will turn on equalizer APO. Correction. Equalizer APO was already turned on. I have now turned off Equalizer APO and left Voice Meter Banana alone. Nothing else was changed.
And that has been my test run once again. And behind the scenes, all that goodness. Don't really know how you. F I could maybe figure that. Never mind. Until we meet again. This is Equalizer APO with VB output selected. VB output settings 1 turned on. This is Equalizer APO with VB output selected. VB output settings 2. This is Equalizer APO with VB selected. VB output settings 3. This is Equalizer APO turned off. VB settings 1. This is Equalizer APO turned off, VB settings 2. This is Equalizer APO turned off, VB settings 3. This is Equalizer APO turned on, VB turned off. This is regular microphone without, VB turned on, and without Equalizer APO turned on, basic microphone only. Welcome back, YouTube, to another video. Right now, I am trying out a new light source, which is actually irritating me, but can't really do nothing about that. Meaning I have light staring into my left eye. But I'm going to try to combine this light with now my wall light. To this is now with, so let me see if Okay, back. I hate my USB hard uh, port, whatever. This is without. Okay. I'm gonna turn that back on. God, I hate this lamp. And now. Hmm. Okay, durable. Better. Uh, so this is now with the light source. Good. Very good. And also with my voice meter going as well. So the audio is different. So this is another test to see what is going on. And one more thing that I wanted to do. I wonder if I could 
Yeah, give me a sharpen on that. Make it not that much. Okay, that's the sharpen of the background. Um, what else can I do on this? Color key. Smoothness, what does that do? Okay. Contrast makes it brighter. No. Brightness, nope. Gamma. What a little bit darker. Okay. Ooh, I like that. Yeah, I, I definitely like that. Um, Momo key. I think that's new? Don't. Oh, okay. Can't, you just can't see it. Oh. Okay. I will probably never use that. It's like a green screen thing. Vendor delay, scale and aspect scroll. Uh, oh, color correction, that's what I was looking for. Whoop, whoop. Make it black and white. Uh, no. What about a hue show? Ooh, okay. Huh. I don't know. I'm thinking that for now, because I'm, I'm all blue. Instead of gold, I'm going to try this blue now. So I think I have that uh, figured out, and now I have this light source, so it's a little bit better. However, this lamp runs <laughs> on a freaking light light, so not the best, but I make do with what I have. So, yay. So, a little bit easier now on not so much glare back there, but light source. Gotta have one. So, yeah, that, that has been behind the scenes uh, nonsense. Um, but now you know what's going on, and I got a new uh, video test of the base now. Oh, speaking of that, I never actually... Okay, I'm gonna do something. Turn you around. No gain. Okay, I heal nothing now. This is without any gain. And now, gain. Anything. Anything. Dead man! Ow. Okay. That's not good. Okay. How about... This. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just being so silly. How about this? This. This. Hmm. How about... Okay, th that's a little bit better. How about... No. No. Base, base, base. Hmm. Base, base. How about... How about this one? How about... In the middle. No. 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 This one? Hmm. Okay. I think I have it now. Does virtual input is anything? Negative 12. Plus 12. No. No, I don't think it does. Note to self. 
EQ. <coughs> No, I don't think. Okay, how about... And... Anything. Anything. No. 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 Default. Left. No, I'm keeping that. Up. Okay. Okay, that's better. And enough of that, and I think I have my audio correct now. Yeah, you, you can see my knobs, but yeah, that's where my stuff is on the mic, so yep. Uh, I could look at uh, voice meter banana and try to monkey with that because I think it has a little bit more settings. I guess I'm gonna save this. Save my settings because I have it correctly now. No idea if, if my microphone is even working right now, so... No, I don't... okay. Settings... Save one. Put you in video... uh, put you in music, actually. Save. Oh, are you gonna save? Hello? Can I not save it? Try that again. Okay, did not save. Save, please. Save. Uh, it's probably because of that stupid, yeah. Okay, that time it saved. Okay. Now go get voice mater banana. And see what this does. I'm just gonna I'm not doing the audio cable that people tell you to get. All that does is if you're playing Spotify or something that music from your browser will go into your audio cord thing I don't know I don't need it cuz I don't play music in my uh, stuff when I'm gaming okay so I need banana download Uh, the, okay, that's, yeah, it has a little bit more stuff. Kind of like, uh, Audacity, but... <sighs> Better, I mean, it has more stuff. I'm trying to like see if it actually says what what I'm trying to do, but <laughs> nope. So that's fun. Are you the? I think that you're the new one. Yeah, you're the new one.
Okay, I have to reboot uh, reboot my computer for that to take effect. So now this is without voice meter at all. So I'm going to now go to my recording device, put you on default, default, default. And I think you can, okay. So now I have to now click apply, click OK, go back to playback, turn on my speakers, set default, and default. So this is without voice meter. Very, okay, this is without the gain that I had. Slowly increasing, ooh. Okay, this is kind of what I had originally, I think. <laughs> I had to. So this is, no, no. Okay. I have that set. More like right there, yes, right there. Default mic settings. Increased gain to a little bit to the left, so. And now I'll stop listening to the microphone. And now this is without voice meter and lowered the gain on the microphone. And now I have to reboot. And then I will see what I can do with the voice meter banana. Welcome back to another video. And hello, new Leiden. Uh, right now I am testing my mic before I open voice meter banana. I've been monkeying around with my audio for my audio and voice meter. Uh, okay, so back up. I had voice meter, basic. I have no voice meter banana or regular basic voice meter. So no edits whatsoever, which is just the microphone, which is right now. Then we have voice meter banana. So I will now run voice meter banana with the new uh, settings that I have. Also testing out the new background as well and my new light source, which is awesome. What about... Oh. Uh. Okay, that's this. Uh, okay. Okay, it's not. Okay, there it is. Okay. So now I have to change my recording devices into the proper channels. I think the cable is this one. I think. One way to find out. Test. Okay. Now this is with voice meter banana. I have EQ and 
compressor of 1.2. And I just messed that up. I think it was around here. Okay, reset my settings. Load settings. So I have one. I have... I have two setting presets. One was with voice meter basic and now I have voice meter banana preset so one without one with okay this is without equal actually it is this is with EQ this is now without EQ with but I have no preset in that What in the world do I mean? Okay, I click on the EQ. It's flat, so there's nothing in there. I I try to monkey with that, but so this is now voice meter banana test. Upped the mic uh, sensitivity, in other words, the loudness of my voice. So this microphone is now picking up more. So, I do not have the proper settings yet. So, th that is why there's all these new videos going out. Because I am trying to up my quality again. Which is a good thing to make it better. So, this is with voice emitter banana so I'm gonna turn this off now this is now just my mic no edit whatsoever no processing plain no filters just the mic itself. Now I have found a video on YouTube. I just found him and this video was released on November 13, 2019 and and though I have found myself an equalizer program or software called Equalizer APO. Then there is something called VST plugins, followed by his Discord channel. And I have not set that up. He has a preset for the APO from his blue snowball. I have the blue Yeti. Completely different. It's so he has the cheapest microphone on the list, which is the snowball. I have the one above it, which costed about a hundred. So I will get back to you on that preset with APO, set that all up, and test that out and see what happens until we meet again. Welcome back to another video, and I just found out that all the previous videos that I did, OBS was picking up on, uh, what, what's my output again? Just my Yeti, so you could not tell what the 
output it was. So, uh, whoops. Luckily, I can choose voice meter with uh, settings into voice meter banana. So you can actually hear the difference now. So I just now found that out. So this is just my Yeti, nothing added. I could be wrong about this, but OBS is right now just recording my microphone only. So this is going to be a test. Again, so my video, okay, my recording right now from the PC is Yeti only. So I have to now pick Ox and put aux on this because right now audacity is still picking up on the yeti and that's why i can still see the microphone going up and down so i said the aux okay What about, okay, found it, the correct settings, so I'm gonna pop that into, okay, this is now with voice meter banana settings, so I will now show you in Audacity because I have been not doing that lately. So I'm, okay, this is now what I have. So you can see it in the beginning of the video, Yeti was on without voice meter banana. Now in this, you can see I have voice meter banana going through. OBS is now picking up the right microphone in this video. In my previous videos, it might have not been set up correctly, meaning I forgot to change OBS microphone into the correct one. So if it did pick it up, oh, this is also without a one, so... Uh, so now, uh, yeah, uh, sidetrack, um, yeah. Okay, now I am going to turn off 
EQ because it is flat. There was nothing to it. Now I'm going to choose without compression. This is now without compression, but still with voice meter banana settings minus the compression. So I just flipped through that. Now, now I will load the voice meter basic settings. This is with voice meter basic settings. No compressor, no EQ. You can see the difference though. Now I will flip back to voice meter banana settings. I prefer voice meter banana with the compressor compression. And this is before I monkey with the equalizer APO preset that I have found. Also, side note, when I, okay, I'm going to turn on A1, you might heal this. Now, my speakers are showing, picking up my microphone. Therefore, this might sound weird to you because two voices going through. A1 makes it to where you hear your microphone in your speakers. Now, this is without. So, if my voice sounded weird, it was probably because I had A1 turned on. Forgot to mention that in the video, so that could have made it very bassy. So, I'm turning you off and... Yeah. So now you have seen all my voice edits processing that I have made. Starting with regular blue yeti, nothing added. Then we have voice meter basic. Then we have voice meter banana with compressor and without. The EQ is flat, therefore there is no EQ. However, I have it on, but there is nothing there because I have not edited that section. I tried, couldn't really figure it out. Then I saw this new video with the equalizer APO with a preset, so I will now go try that and see you in another video. Welcome back YouTube to another video. I have an EQ going on through the equal Equalizer APO, testing out the new settings. I also found a voice meter banana preset, going to see what that does as well.
if I can figure out how to load it. Okay, EQ. Um, oh, okay. Cable output speakers. Okay, I have it load in, but now I need to change OBS to the new microphone settings in voice meter banana. This is APO equalizer. Hopefully I have this correct voice box output. A voice get on this. No? Okay, never mind. I I figured it out. So this is now with voice meter banana preset. Which I have not heard for myself. Turn it on A1. Hmm. I believe is this with both? I'm going to turn off the APO. This is now just voice meter banana. Okay. Now it is just voice meter banana. Okay, wait. Testing. Nope. Same thing. Voice meter banana preset. Now, does it sound any better? No. It turns out I prefer I prefer my voice meter banana settings. So turn off that noise gate, go into the EQ and see what it yeah. The other one sounded better. Shutting down voice meter. Okay, we are back with the Yeti and APO. Now I am going to turn off APO.
APO is now fully turned off. This is now just Blue Yeti microphone only. Nothing added. Now, this is with Equalizer APO only. I think I will be using this one now. Right. Oh, no, it's still working. Okay, for a moment there, I thought it wasn't. Until we meet again. Welcome back, YouTube, with another video. I forgot to compile the voice meter banana my settings versus my settings in equalizer APO. And so I have three things, microphone versus APO or microphone versus voice meter banana my settings. We are on regular microphone, I believe. Settings, go to audio. Yes, we are on regular microphone Yeti without APO. And this is now with APO Equalizer APO. We are back with the regular microphone as I load Voice Meter Banana once again and change that into my voice meter banana settings. Now I have to change OBS into the proper microphone channel. I think it's this one. Okay, now I have to change my recording device to voice meter output. Okay, now I'll make sure that this is on the right one in OBS. Okay, we are on the right channel now. I'm gonna test. No, can't. Okay, but it's still going through. Good. Okay. Test in one, two, three. A one on. A1 off. And this is without APO, equalizer APO. And this is the last video I am going to upload about microphones. Hopefully that I have found the right settings for me. I can either go with Voice Meter Banana or Equalizer APO or just my regular microphone with nothing added.
until we meet again. Welcome back, YouTube. This is one last video because I checked the video or audio of the last video and it sounds like my voice emitter banana does nothing to my mic. I mean, I had voice emitter banana on with my settings, but Apparently, OBS doesn't really care. So right now, this is on regular Yeti, but when I up the switch to Voice Emitter Banana, I'm going to do that right now. And also, this is with APO. Voice <laughs> Equalizer APO. So I can turn this off again. Okay. Now, this is microphone without voice meter banana loaded and without equalizer APO. Standard microphone. Now, as I turn on voice meter banana, what will happen? It will probably stay the same. My microphone, the sound will probably stay the same. From the looks of it, it, it is. So this is a small test for myself rather than... I think I will up, uh, upload this uh, publicly at another time. Okay, Voice Mater Banana is now loaded. Now as I change my settings, of OBS to my voice meter output, what will happen? Stay the same or change? This is before I hit apply. I hit apply. What happened? Did it stay the same or did it change? This is, once again, my uh, voice meter banana settings with compression and all of that. And I am changing my desktop microphone from Yeti to voice meter output as well, but that never really does anything because when you already set it in the program, it's already set, so that's just the default microphone, but uh, sometimes you do need to change it, but I just did and did it change or did it stay the same? Only one way to find out. Shutting down voice meter banana. We are back with the OBS on the Yeti without APO going through. Regular microphone, nothing to it. Going to load Voice Meter Banana once again. And this is without me changing my main default mic to Yeti. And apparently 
OBS is still picking up the microphone without me changing it in Windows. So the default doesn't really matter at this point. So long as OBS is pointing to voice meter banana. So I will do that now. Again. Voice meter output. Apply. Now we are on voice meter banana. Now I'm going to turn on APO. This is now with Equalizer, APO, and Voice Meter Banana. Does this do anything? And if so, which version do I prefer? And ob no, OBS is working. Okay. Until we meet again. Okay, we are back. I thought I forgot to load voice meter banana on that one. This is my final test because I'm just having them in separate parts rather than link them all together. So this is now with voice meter banana and with Equalizer APO, all of my settings loaded. Now I'm going to turn off Equalizer APO. Does this do anything? My question is that, does voice meter banana change? Because sometimes it is barely noticeable. But with equalizer APO, it is more noticeable. I am going to turn on equalizer APO. Now, <coughs> ah. pardon me. Now, this is with equalizer APO and voice meter banana. <coughs> So far, I am leaning towards Equalizer APO, but do I want it with Voice Meter Banana if it does anything to it? So this is the combined before I turn off Voice Meter Banana because chances are my regular microphone will be pretty much the same, if not exact. Uh, with Voice Meter Banana, the sounds were pretty much the same. It is barely noticeable, the effect that I was going for. It depends on the sound I am making. I have a no test, but for me, I want it on all the sounds, not just certain words will pick up on it. 
if I am being clear. So all these videos will be posted at a later date because I have made so many. And why not for future reference and people might want to know how I got to well I am in the future. Cool. I am going to turn off voice meter banana now. Okay, we are back with my Yeti and APO. It just occurred to me that you can change uh, to add... Okay, I'm going to close APO and restart it. Closed out of APO. Is it still running? Apparently, yes, it is. Okay, I am going to reopen it. Does that little window? No, it does not. Okay. I need to add a device. Um, how do I do that? Um, Okay, I, um, hmm, what do I, oh, configurator, that's it, okay, I need to put it on voice meter output A1, then the equalizer APO will configure the voice meter output. Right now I just have Yeti going through it and I don't know if voice meter output will be what it does so I'm going to add voice meter output to this and now I have to reboot. So, yeah. Once again, this is with APO equalizer APO with Yeti and without voice meter banana. What will happen? Until the next part of this. And forgot to turn that on. Extend. Display to. And we are back. Need to turn on my light source. Of course it did. Nope. Okay, it had to reload. Okay. Normal, regular video with my newfound settings on my mic. We are using Equalizer APO, uh, a preset that I tweaked. Um, right now I'm just testing it out. But I have been meaning to 
discuss. Um, for the last uh, three videos of Project Extension, I felt the energy of Archangel Michael flowing through me again flowing through me which in turn amplified my magic my power my light and I got pretty much the same matches three times but each post was different uh Nothing is happening for today since I have been working on editing uh, my mic quality and getting that all set up and so much time has been put into that and then just testing out the different, uh, the different mics basically and this has been a regular video um, with my new settings. Uh, I'm trying to see if there is any messages um, coming through. Um, I just hear the usual uh, keep up the good work, continue on the path, continue forward, fighting those demons that hold you back, uh, de-block yourself, um, meaning I created unknown obstacles that I now have to break and overcome, but that is the usable standard life down here. Break through the obstacles, overcome your inner personal demons, but at the same time, you are more light than you are darkness. However, you cannot change your true uh, identity. Your soul is what it is. You cannot change your race. Meaning, if you are born as an earth angel, you cannot become something you're not unless you fall victim to the evil ways, the devil at work. But... For me, being an earth angel, I came from 90, I am here to spread my light into the world, attracting others who will align themselves with me and become a part of my community who shall similar beliefs, they accept what I say to a distant de degree, they either agree to a point, sometimes they will disagree with what I have to say, but most of the time you align with me, you vibe with me, but for a demon, you how do I back it up? As an earth angel, I am all light. However, I found that light from being born into a personal hell. I was brought up via demons. What in the world do I mean? Demons attacked me, which in turn made me realize, you know what, I do not agree with this treatment. I do not agree with 
your energy. I am above this toxicness. I am above this negativity. Without that darkness, I would have never found my inner light. It's it's weird because on Earth there was nothing but darkness. On ninety, five D, anywhere in between, you have nothing but light. You are a light being, full, without shadow, without darkness. You are just emitting so much light, like a star. That is why so many people say they are star seeds because. The sun is a star; it is also a light source. But without that darkness, we cannot see our light. However, Earth is a personal hell. You're either, well, for me, I woke up from hell. I walked through it. I rose. I did not stay in negativity. I was not a bully. Think about that for a minute. Why do bullies bully? They have. Well, are they innocent? By innocent, I mean. Is the soul demonic by nature, or are they a light being who was consumed by the devil and his ways? Therefore, he is this bully is attacking the innocent because he feels like he can't change, he can't see beyond. What he has become, so he attacks innocent people. He bullies them. But is this bully really just a demon, or is he a light being who cannot see their own light and could not level up? So he remained a monster. Hard to say.、Uh, for me, as a light being, I rose up from hell. I did not become a monster, even though there was a there was a time where I thought I was a demon. However, that was not true. I was led to believe that because I was told. Magic, Wicca, paganism, anything that revolves around that was considered evil. So I began to see my magic as evil, that my dragon flame as evil, because I was told it was. However, moving into the future, into the now. My magic is not evil. My dragon flame is not evil. So, what is a bully? He. It's it's hard to hard to say because there are going to be light people that have succumbed to the darkness. Um. You cast, okay. Uh, what happens when you shine a flashlight at in the middle of night? That light will cast a shadow. You will see a shadow. So, as a light being, you are all light, but. When your light casts a shadow or sees a darkness, you will go all ragey. You will attack this shadow or become it, forgetting 
you are above that, you are divine, you are more powerful than this demon, this shadow. There are many people who do not know or cannot remember their light, so they become more darkness than light, but at the same time, you cannot change your race, your soul race. You are what you are. But for a light being, you can either toss everything into the wind and say, you know what, I'm not of light, I'm a demon, I will go crazy. But you also have to remember, are you attacking a demon who is attacking you, or have you become a demon because you cannot remember your light? You never found it. But there is more to that story. Um, I'm trying to to think. Ah. Uh, Demons will mask themselves as light. They will make you avoid your light. Do not go into the light. Love everyone, including the monsters. And some people are just plain insane when they talk. I've had my show reading a crazy responses and I looked at it like uh they'll demonic because they um it's hard to explain this to a 4D person because either you're well of it, meaning your third eye is completely open and you can see this for what it is, or you're not at that level and you agree with them, but you are misguided. Demons can come in many forms, many shapes, um, so become aware of that is one of the, the hard parts, and right now I can just see it my third eye is, is open. Um, so, um, I'm trying to think of how else to describe this. Oh, I know. Demons will abuse people. Demons will abuse animals. Demons are energy vampires they are fake friends they are toxic um they will tell you to forgive and love your enemies even though why on earth would you do that i will never forgive and i will never love my demonic ex who I am glad I never met in person. Um, why? He was an energy vampire, and he lied to me, he manipulated me, abused me, and these people are trying to tell me to forgive him for hurting you, love him, I can't. You're telling me to love and to forgive evil. I refuse to do that. And I found out when I did do that, I rose higher. Because I said I burned that, I burned that bridge. And I rose higher rather than continuing to forgive and to love him. 
Because when I did do that, what happened? Energy, vampire, and the cycle never... The madness, the madness continued and continued. The toxic continued. The negativity continued. The arguments continued. And you're trying to tell me to love and to forgive that, and I can't. That is a demon telling me to do that, to make me lower myself. So you have to become a whale of demonic thinking. Demons will manipulate you. They will make you change your views and your thinking. But you're not doing that. The demon is forcing you to do that. For me, I have no outside forces anymore. I either align or I don't. Demons will not affect me anymore in that way. Um, I'm trying to think, is that everything? As a light bane, you either throw out everything into the wind, become a demon, because you either forgot your light, or you were born a demon who is becoming what they really are. It is very hard to say what your soul rays is. Only you can decide on that yourself. But as a light being, you are trying to return to 5D. You are trying to return to 9D. Rather than staying on 3D, 4D, becoming like the other people who are obsessed with chaos, darkness, evil, gossip, rumors, and anything else that lowers your vibration. As a light worker, as a light being, I am... Letting go of all the negativity to make me rise higher, to relearn my soul, to evolve into the light, to hold nothing but light. Out with the chains, out with the darkness, in with the light. However, not many people can relate and understand my posts. All they say is love the demons, love the enemies. Then to tell me, oh, they did not mean that. Well, you should not tell me to love everyone then. Do not say to me, love everyone Love will win. No. You cannot love a demon. You cannot love your enemies. You cannot love your haters. The only thing you can do... No, wait. What? The only time love will win is when you love yourself and the people who support you rather than I am going to turn the other cheek and look the other way and pretend this evil act never happened. I forgive you. I love you. Jesus will save you. No. Jesus will not save you. 
you have to save yourself. And you wonder why the world is in shambles right now, breaking apart, going into World War uh, Three and or World War Four. Who knows? Uh, I did see a, a post that World War Three is happening. However, I personally don't really pay attention to that. The thing that I pay attention to is demons versus angels. Demons versus humans, and humans are going, I don't know what to do. I am trapped in the matrix. Jesus, save me from the demons. Do you heal what you're saying? Do you heal what your prayers are saying? The answer is, you're a lunatic because you have to save yourself, empower your own self, but you're too busy either staring at a wall, staring at the floor, or, um, what was the third one? Well, there's multiple prayer positions, so the only two that stuck in my mind, okay, I'm gonna pray to the invisible man and hope my life will change. Oh, please save me from the demons. Heal my prayer. Please save me. No, you have to save yourself. You have to empower yourself. But you're too busy listening and following to others. You are closed minded and, quite frankly, stupid. But that is what I have noticed on all the cartoons, all these shows, uh, and the U.S. So if it's outside of anime, which came from Japan, chances are it is going to be retarded and stupid. They want the masses to get dumber so you don't wake up and you don't empower yourself and... You stay asleep because when you are asleep, you are easier to control. But no one sees this, hardly. I've only encountered a handful who see it. That's why I, I say it like that. For the majority of the planet, you are all asleep. You are just following the crowd, not waking up and not remembering your true power and your true magic. And, yeah. So, yeah, you're either a wolf, a sheep, or a unicorn, or a dragon. But that is for you to find out and for you to figure out your own soul. Not listening to the demons, not listening to the haters. You are listening to the only voice that matters is your own voice, your own soul. You are not listening to the outside forces. You have researched on your own, and you have listened to your thinking patterns. I've done my own research. It took me a long time to get to where I am. And not relying on outside forces. I listen to the only voice that matters, my own. If you align with me, then we can exchange comments and chances are what you have said, I also align with it because we are almost on the same page. I see it differently, you see it differently, but it is 
it is in the same scenario almost, the same feeling almost. Scenario, situation, however you want to say it. Uh, for for instance, you could agree with this video, and then give me something new to think about, or did you notice this too, or something, or you could be, you know what. I am talking out my gas. I don't know what I am talking about. You're crazy. Are you on drugs? Um, that's a demon talking. And as for a troll, you'll just call me a wacko and uh, harass me. Also a demon. But, yeah. Until we meet again. Welcome back, YouTube, to another video. We are now using Voice Meter Banana into Equalizer APO. And this is another long video with this setting in order for me to decide what effect do I want. Mic only or voice meter banana or voice meter banana and equalizer APO. With that being said, what have I noticed when I tweaked my mic? One, the quality is better. When you increase the quality to get the sound you are looking for, senses are your power of your voice will be increased so you're so you hear a deeper voice and I don't know it's it just to me it's more powerful like the aura behind it the energy behind it that is what I am beginning to notice the better the quality the better ch of the energy back in that sound that voice and that is why I have done so many videos on trying to figure out where I want my mic to be at that is why I have done, oh, I'm going to tweak this and then compel the two, but uh, for me, it's do a video on each setting because when I did it all in one video, I could never decide because I, I did one part too short, another part too long. Therefore, it is better to do single videos only on each effect until you get the right one. But that has been my take on the quality on uh, equalizers bassy sounds, no processing in audacity. Every time I tried that, it 
made things worse, though, for I relied only on Blue Yeti Serpa, or whatever that program is, which was released to update your mic. And now I am trying out Voice Meter Banana, and now I found Equalizer APO and trying that. Can't decide on which one, why not combine the two and see what happens, which has been in this video. Previously, it was Equalizer APO only. Voice Mater Basic is okay, but I needed the compressor. I don't know, I just wanted the Voice Mater Banana, and it seems to work better. But if there was a compressor and Voice Mater, I missed it. But, yeah, that's, um, gonna be it for this video. Until we meet again. I forgot to tell OBS to change over to Voice Meter Banana. But, I'm pretty sure the uh, Equalizer APO was picking up on Voice Meter Banana and I was using both of them. But I wanted to add this video at the end, or a test to see. This has been OBS with the proper mic channel. Is there any difference? And no OBS was not picking up the sound from both. It was just voice meter banana. Now I have OBS picking up on both voice meter banana and equalizer APO. I prefer this one now. Uh, over regular voice emitter banana. I don't know what it is, but to my ears, I think I will be using this uh, microphone sound uh, for a while now, just to see. But for now, I think I like this one the best. Not entirely sure yet, um, but yeah, and once again, I forgot to change OBS to Voice Mater Banana, so it was picking up my Blue microphone only. I am unsure if Voice Meter Banana was tweaking my microphone or not. That probably wasn't because OBS was just focused on my regular microphone and not Voice Meter Banana with APO. So, it, 
what I had was OBS with my microphone with APO and not voice meter banana. You can tell I am getting tired. So I will strain all these three videos together uh, to correct my mistake. On second thought, I will... I will strain all of the audio videos that I have made into one long video to see that my process of how I got to this stage and then I will also add in another long video for just my mic only at the very end. So this has been with Voice Mater Banana and Equalizer APO. And just to make sure, settings and go to audio, voice meter output is selected. So OBS is putting out the right stuff. I will see you in the next part. Welcome back to the next part. This is just my microphone without voice meter banana and without equalizer APO. In the previous video part, I forgot to change my device in from Yeti to voice meter output in equalizer APO. But it does give me a little bit more length to this part of the video so I can hear the difference better now. Until we meet again in the next part length and then this video into many different parts just so I know which one I prefer until we meet again in the next part of this video Welcome back. This is Yeti with Vor uh, Equalizer APO only. No voice meter banana in this part of the video. Just another simple test, non video part to see to heal which effect that I want and need. Welcome back. <clears throat> well, if I was more awake yesterday, I would have realized I was making too many mistakes with the audio outputs. Therefore, I am. This is the end to that sequence of videos. I am stringing them together now, minus the long 27 one because that was 27 minutes, and I believe. 
I did not have that in the right output going. In other words, I had OBS on the wrong output, probably. I kept, uh, I, in other words, I was, let's make a circle and forget to change the output correctly. So I kept making the same mistake and I, if I was more awake, I would have made a PowerPoint presentation and then read those steps and everything would have been better. So this has been a process, a long one, because I kept talking like for several hours yesterday trying to get it correctly, but I kept making the same mistake and, and yeah, so this is the ending video of that long string of videos for a, I made a mistake, here's what I did, here is what I will do to correct the mistake, and here is what I needed or should have done. So with this video, standard microphone only. Until we meet again.